Destiny Jokum. I'm Sian. And I'm Aniola. Thanks for tuning in this morning with Jokum News. So let's start off with O Canada sung by Miss Penafield's class. Oh. Out of our deep respect for Indigenous peoples in Canada, we would like to acknowledge that Toronto District School Board properties are situated upon traditional territories. The territories include the Wendat, the Anishinaabeg Nation, the Haudenosaunee Confederacy, the Mississaugas of the New Credit First Nations, the Mississaugas of Scugog, Hiawatha, Alderville First Nation, and the Métis Nation. We also recognize the enduring presence of Aboriginal peoples on this land. In the name of the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit, Amen. Jesus, today the day appears to be gigantic, and my heart is suffocating with the weight of the world. Right now, I can't think of the past hour, much less the entire day. This moment alone threatens his mother, and I need your love to fill me, as life transcends from you. May every breath rely on the same. Your holy power to inhale from me, to exhale from me, and to breathe through me, to reveal the essence of your glory. In the name of the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit, Amen. Hi, St. Jokum staff and students. There will be no school on May 23rd. It will be a long weekend to celebrate and honor Queen Victoria. And make sure to see the fireworks at night. Wow, okay. During this week, scientists have discovered a 450 million year old fossil, and it has been found in Ontario. Pretty cool, right? Yeah. And now let's head on to Yosef and Ms. Pat with our sports. Thanks, Mel. Sadly, the Toronto Maple Leafs lost on Saturday against the Tampa Bay Lightning. And our season is over. They will now be spending their summer on a golf course. Toronto FC is off to a rocky start and currently sit in 12th place. They take on DC United this Saturday at BMO Field, so make sure to cheer them on. And go Toronto FC, go! The Toronto Blue Jays are back at home and currently sit in 3rd place in their division. They just finished their series against the Seattle Mariners and will be taking on the Cincinnati Reds this weekend, so be sure to cheer on the Jays. Go Jays, go! And now we will head on to our track and field practices with Nico. Track and field meet is next week Thursday, so good luck to all our runners and field events participants. Don't forget to wish them good luck before next week. Thanks, the quote of this week is, everybody wants change, but nobody's willing to be the change. Now let's, out, let's head over to Riddle with Kugel. Thank you, Yosef. This week's riddle is, what can't talk but will apply when spoken to? What am I? Moving on to the fact of this week, did you know that your heart beats about 100,000 times a day? How crazy! Real crazy. What do you call a fake noodle? Hmm, what is it? An imposter. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> weather it will be rainy on tuesday and wednesday and thursday and it will be sunny on monday now let's go for over to reese with our birthday celebration thanks anna now happy belated and happy birthdays to serge krishan mel and cody hello saint jacob news so today we're interviewing mr raju for asian heritage month Okay, I'll go first. What is your favorite tradition? What is my favorite tradition? It is, uh, we are a very diversified culture where we have in uh, people of all kind of uh, religion blended together. So we have Hindus, Muslims, we have Christians, all like a fusion. And uh, that is how our culture is with a lot of traditions and we celebrate almost like all the festivals 
of everyone, whether it is a Hindu festival, whether it is a Christian festival, or whether it is a Muslim festival. We all enjoy and we share that together. Yeah. We'll end the interview with that. Um, thank you for coming in, Mr. Andrew. Okay. Nanji, Monica. Bye. Yeah. Now on to politics. Today we have Isabella and Sesson here from the grade 6 class to talk to us more about the upcoming election. As you know, the provincial election will take place on June 2nd. We'll also be holding our student vote that day for grades 5 to 8. An important part of voting is making sure that you'll know who's running to represent your writing in each party and what they stand for. Today we'll review the candidates in Scrubber Southwest. You will likely have seen some of their advertisements or lawn signs in the neighborhood. The four main parties in alphabetical order are the Greens, the Liberals, the NDP, and the Progressive Conservatives. The Green Party candidate is Cara Vidal, and the party leader is Mark Schreiner. The Liberal Party candidate is Lisa Pradell, and the party leader is Stephen Del Duca. The NDP Party candidate is Dolly Begum, and their party leader is Andrea Harwas. The Progressive Conservative Party candidate is Brett Snyder, and the party leader is Doug Ford. Voting is a right and responsibility of Canadian citizenship. Be active, inform yourself, and get out and vote. Thank you so much. Please welcome back to Ms. Chan's grade 5 class for another amazing performance. This time, Bollywood. Bollywood dance originated in India and was created by combining the two names, Bombay and Hollywood. <laughs> Now here's a short slideshow and photos of Miss Sabulano and Miss Wigglesworth class field trip to the farm. Enjoy! <music> The medicine was saying it might goat. bite you. The little goat sniffed me. The little goat sniffed me. He wants to eat it. Them, okay, you're gonna watch yeah. Maddie do it though, okay? Yeah. 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 Look at this.
this little baby. He's our baby, one of our babies. He's only a year old. about you standing on there but <laughs> oh my god guys it's so high strike a pose <laughs> let me see your best poses guys one okay ready one two three smile